And here we are putting up Casey's first right choice listing for sale sign. It's an exciting day. Yes. It's really early. <laughs> I'm excited as I can be this early. Love it. Hi Rose, it's Kevin, how are you? Pretty good, how are you? I'm good, thank you. Uh, I've got Casey here with me because we got some good news for you. Woohoo! What's that? Uh, your house, the conditions are, are done, so your house is officially sold. Yay! 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 Isn't that awesome? So, I'm just on my way to work, so that's good news. Yeah, that is you good news. Come on, right? You will have a, a sold sign on the on the front, yeah. Okay, thanks. Have a Thank great day. Guys. Bye, Rose. Okay, bye-bye. Today I'm meeting with Casey here at a listing that she is just about to put on the market. She's told me a lot about this house and I cannot wait to see the view outside of the backyard. Apparently it's got a view overlooking that you can see all the way out to Toronto. So Casey's gonna be getting the paperwork signed up. We're gonna be taking some pictures, some videos, getting things ready to get this on the market and I can't wait to take a look inside. Casey just gave me a wonderful tour of this home and it's got a lot of really nice features. Including this Muskoka room with this a beautiful view out into the backyard. And right now, as I sit here enjoying this view, she's sitting behind with the sellers going all over all of the paperwork to get this home listed up on the market. I'm trying to keep it down, I don't want to interrupt. Casey is just finishing up going over the listing paperwork with her sellers here at this beautiful home in St. Catharines. And I think she has done a phenomenal job. You can definitely see her attention to detail and how much she cares about her sellers. We're here at my soon to be newest listing in St. Catharines. We just finalized the paperwork, went through the listing, got it all signed up, did our photos, video, coming so very soon, in a few days. On our way to Carlton, we gotta go and change the for sale sign into a sold sign. Uh, it was a good listing and I've got a good little video that I wanna put together on what makes this listing a little bit different and how the process was different uh, for myself and for Joe. So we're headed there now, get it flipped and get a video shot. Just flipped the sold sign at my listing at Carlton Street. Uh, this listing was a lot different. Uh, it actually started months ago before I was even a part of Right Choice. Joe came here, did a comparative market analysis and they actually wanted to get more for the house. So instead of doing the old school thing where they listed really high, they actually listened to Joe and then when I came along, they listened to me. They put in a little bit of money into some key places to get a good return and make more money for their house. Uh, like I said, it was before I was even here. It was just with Joe, but then when I came, they were like, actually, we'd rather just have you do it to make us the most amount of money. So then I ended up listing it, but they did a great job putting all of their um, investments, if you will, into the right places and got an awesome return for the investment. And we had a very good listing and now we've got a sold listing. It is an exciting day at Right Choice today. I am putting on my very first for sale sign here in St. Catharines. Yes, love it. Let's see her get on there. For sale. That's Old what fish. I'm talking about. Uh, just here to go over a comparative market analysis that I put together for this uh, nice couple having issues uh, with a tenant on their Wayne Fleet property. Uh, it's a beautiful property. They're ready to sell it because they've got a tenant not paying uh, the rent on it. So I had to put together comparative market analysis and we're about to go over it with them and put together a game plan, a strategy for their listing. So same thing, find the solds. The other thing I do is Try and look at some actives that you might be competing with. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because depending on the competition, if there's none, that's good for your price and you yeah, can manipulate it a bit. 
So we picked the four solds. Uh, I have them ordered in most comparable to least. But your house is newer. Mm -hmm. uh, it's got nicer finishings inside. Mm -hmm. So I felt like that kind of offset yeah, the fact yeah. that it says a double garage there. Mm -hmm. There was one that was ended up selling lower. I think mm -hmm. it was 580. Mm -hmm. It was an older house, but it was massive. It had like 2,500 square feet. Oh. This one was more comparable. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's got a three car garage. The square foot's 1,900. But like I said, yeah, 650 would be if that's you yeah. wanted to try it again yeah, yeah it's an option Oops. if we can have the eviction done from the second m5 and it's done and then we list mm -hmm. that would be ideal for you yeah um, but if we need to list it to get the tenant out we can do that too when you call the lawyer like before we decide anything you can call the lawyer and ask yeah. them if we list it obviously it's better for your house if it, there's no one in there mm -hmm. but if we list it now will that help you get the tenant out Mm -hmm. if, if she thinks that it will, then we can put it up. Mm -hmm. As soon as the tenant's out, we can yeah. either cancel it or suspend the listing she, uh, and get it ready and then do it again. Uh, we did have a preview on a nice property. Um, we actually even had a lead come in off of uh, one of our, our stories that we put out during the preview. Uh, that's how interesting the property was. Just previewed, new house for a potential listing, met the sellers, beautiful home, beautiful lot. Got my questions done, got all my notes. Now it's time to go and put as many hours as I need to into the comparative market analysis and see where we go. And it did fall apart. Uh, there were some signs that uh, we weren't there exactly for the reason that we thought we were there. Things like this happen, that's part of real estate and we move on. It was a little bit different of a preview. I don't think we really could have changed uh, any of that. Uh, seller had his plan and, and wanted some experts in to help him with that plan and with the numbers on it. And uh, yeah, we move on and go to the next appointments.